Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And it's. What the heck time is it? Uh, it is just about 3 o'clock in the morning, 2.57 on, on a Saturday morning because I woke up with a leg cramp. I've been moving furniture for a couple days. Having a generally bad time of it. Younger kid has a double ear infection. We're, we're not having lots of fun here. And a couple positive things from video games. Um, one, they increase your pain tolerance. As you forget about what's going on, you're in the game, I guess. And two, if you buy a car, your brain treats it as if you've actually bought a car. It doesn't really know that your car is not real. And I'm going to take advantage of that today and, and get a new car. But first, I'm going to make some room. And I think this is my Sprunk car that I used during the Sprunk battles. And I have, I, you know, there, I got, I picked up this car free. Delivery was free. I picked up an E. Cola and a Sprunk versus car for free. Didn't do anything with those. This one's been fully upgraded. I'm thinking of setting this to this, which is also free, just uh, as a, you know, they have the event livery. I don't know. Is this going to stay forever? I'm really not sure. I think the Sprunk and the E. Cola will. They're there with regular prices again. You know, there's the E. Cola. With the Sprunk livery. You know, the Sprunk livery. That with the, uh, the Sprunk uh, secondaries there, primaries. I think both. But this, I, wanna, I want to make sure I have this car. I don't know. Should I just upgrade the... Uh, the other one. I need gonna need parking at some point. I really can't keep this many of the other. I already have. If I just keep one of these, I'll have three three hot ring sabers. They got the, the American flag one. I got the uh, for for the Fourth of July videos. I got my main racer. Maybe I'll keep it on the other character. I did put one on the other character. Leave this because this is the one I did the racing with. And then yeah, I'll just get rid of these. Get rid of these two. Double check, make sure I still have it over there, and then it's a path forward. Do we have? have some some room here. Yeah, we have three. That will work. I'm gonna probably move this to one of the other garages. Maybe I'll move a couple of these cars to other garages as well, but I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing with that today, but let's let's look at what's up. Now we have a couple cars here. The Dinka Kanjo SJ, which is a coupe. You think you think this would be a compact, but it's a coupe. It's a very slow coupe. I already have the trade price for it because I've got enough rank in the uh, in the, uh, the what the hell do they even call that the car show thing. You know what I'm talking about. I got enough prestige that I have that. Not planning on getting this one though. That's this is not a million dollar car to me. It's it's the second slowest coupe. I'm not sure how much. Maybe there's a lot of customization to it. Maybe you have an attachment to this particular car. I can realize that. I, I would love for them to put, you know, my uh, my Thunderbird in there. I have, a, I have a 96 Thunderbird that I think needs to be in this game. It's in GTA 4. They could do it as the Fortune. So I can understand that. I want to get out that far back. I'm all right. But I'm thinking... They have the pose... It's a, it's, it's a Honda Prelude. I, I've never owned a Honda Prelude. So I don't have an attachment to the prelude, but I feel like I can do something goofy with this. I feel like this could be something that could be a rusty jack car, depending on what kind of liveries they have. And for 982, we've got some some uh, some money here. Considered the dark horse of Japanese bubble era car design, 
the postlude, as opposed to the prelude, lost out in a history written by the victorious Elegy and its affordable friends. But to those in the know, this was an injustice waiting to be corrected. Across the mod shops and car meets of San Andreas, a select group of artisans and visionaries are still brought together by their shared love of boxy aesthetics and static sunroofs. Make your voice heard, there are literally dozens of you. Okay. This is, uh, by the way, slower than the other car. I've already seen Ruffy's video on that. Not, this is not going to be fast, but it may be funny. I'm willing to go with funny. I don't think there's too much else. Yeah, I've already got a Futo GTX. I've already got a Salton Classic. I think I already have an RT3. I don't. I never use any of those. The tuners. I never, never really do much with the tuners anymore. All those. Those are always free. I could go back to bed, but we're going to forge ahead here. Anything? The Euros is an interesting, interesting one. I don't remember this one. I drove the Euros before it was cool. That's what you will tell everyone as you drive your newly purchased Annis Euros. Loudly reminisce with the music you didn't listen to, the fashion you never wore, and the parties you didn't get invited to back in the aughts. <laughs> I gotta look this up. And see if this is worth getting. Again, now I don't have a connection to the car, so. For 800, you know. I think I already have an RSX. I think I won an RSX. Cleek, got lots of cliques. They're free sometimes, but. We got a GB200, got a 190Z. We're just killing time here until the car shows up. The tailgater has to have at least one of those. Between the two characters. Cycles, damn it. You have all that matter. Did it ding? Okay, let's go downstairs here. The downstairs is that way. Access the vehicle workshop. Front bumpers. Remove bumper. Okay. Classic bumper. Retro bumper. Painted oil co to cooler and tow hook. That might be the, the route. Let's 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 skip ahead. We need to define the style here. So black shopping list. White shopping list. Dinka dinka dinka. Half camo, Stan San Andreas. Jack or raising, that's kinda neat. Will boil. Prolapse, prolapse inverted. Yeah, that's kinda neat. No rusty version. See I thought I was sure I would get like a rusty jack kind of rusty car here. What the heck is that on the... Is that skulls or something on the... Or... Gas mask? I can't tell. It's you want to make it like a racer or... We want to go more subtle. Wow, I can't really can't really define it by the look there. Let's see. 
I feel like everybody's gonna go on with oil cooler and tow hook kind of things. But then remember, it's not very fast. All right, retro. Let's, let's make it weird. Tow hook and drift charm. It's already got one tow hook. Does it need two tow hooks? Well, I guess it does. Air filters. Front intakes are tempting. I'll go with that. Why not? Tune it up. Strut bait brace. Let's go with the light in the door. Looks like you could take that one out if you need to do maintenance more easily. Yeah, the skulls is a thing. I'm not really into it. Let's go secondary. We'll give it a sec. Not that I ever popped the hood on these anyway. Tuner exhaust. Chrome. V Shokatan, Ultra Shokatan, Shakotan, Zigzag, Superstar, We Love. That is dang silly. We may come back to that. have to come back to this. That's going to depend on how everything else looks. Remove trim. There it is. If you do anything, it removes the trim. So that's kind of good. Secondary arch extensions. Headlight covers. Good. Remove hood. No, Invented. I don't feel like the transparent hood is. So I have one car with that. It doesn't necessarily call to me. Let's go with the scoop secondary. Interior. Yeah, let's go rich with this. Doors, carbon door cards. That's light enough. Roll cage. Pad dash dodger. Seats.
You almost have to change them because they're so low res. Ballistic fiber track seats. There you go. It won't be too comfy, but you won't slide to the left. Rally professional. It's in my legs. Does it have to be in my legs? Look a rally clubman for no reason other than I have to pick something. Lights, headlights will be along with the neon kit, neon layout front, back sides. We think about the color. We'll I don't know what we're going to do here. Livery, we're back to that. I don't know what I'm doing. Respray. It's a prelude. You know? You could definitely go kind of wild with this, but I'm also thinking two-tone brown is not a bad uh, Beechwood with a pearlescent sienna and then secondary color go right for the sienna it is so brown trim color brown Roof, stock roof, antenna, roof rack, roof fins. Carbon arrow roof box, which completely screws up your, your sunroof. Yeah, I'll leave the stock roof. Sunstrips. I'm not big on sunstrips in case you have to actually drive. Splitters. Yeah, I think a secondary splitter works. That's even more 80s. Tuner set up. I kind of like that. I don't know why. I like that. There's some nice detail to it. Spoiler, we need one. Trunk rack. You just have a trunk rack. There you go. Plastic that's high level. Should be a little wild. Ah, secondary street wing. I kind of like that. I do kind of like the the minimalist look to it, though. As far as suspension, we slam it. You gotta, gotta for better. Actually, affects the handling. Turbo tuning. Wheels, wheel type. We're gonna go off roaders with this, I think. I don't know if it has tires can clip or not. A lot of the newer ones don't. Or should we not do this? Should we go back? Maybe some low riders. High end chromes. There, there, there is something to this. Shadow or hyper. What was the slicers? Was that under track? 
tuner track. I mean, I was gonna. My original plan was to go really, really weird with this, and then Speed Boy '90s running. Where's that one that does, like, it's called a slicer. Thank you for bearing, there it is, hold on, there it is, the slicers. The Drift Meister is good. The slicer, the Drift Meister, that's what we're going with. I mean, making this a drift car is pretty much the only thing you can do with it. I need some brownness. Yeah, I love the slicer on my one other car. I have that on it. It really works for it. I think the Driftmeister somehow really, I don't know if it's just the name. Tire design. Yeah. Yeah. Tire smoke. Brown. Windows light smoke, but we're certainly not done yet. See, it's back to headlight covers. Is there anything that really works here with the brown? No, I've been calling to me. Lights, neon kits, neon color. Do they have brown? Is it purple or black light? I think we work with it. Or crew. Can give it the crew lights. A little blue with the brown. Back to livery now. What goes with brown? The dinka racing looks nice. I'm not one for half measures. Dance Andreas. You lose a lot of secondary in there. It does set off the tackle rather nicely. The oil. The prolapse. Skate it like a man. This is the one I think DTA men used when he built his. Not just Colin to me. So, so. The dink of white stripes. That's that's what wins it for me. And with the dink of white stripes. And I'm just wasting money here, but. There's white lights to go with the white stripes. White stripes. Mirrors. We completely missed the mirrors. Classic mirrors, retro mirrors, racing mirrors. Let's go with the racing mirrors. Plate. License, okay. For 44 Yucko. <laughs> Yucko, okay. I might leave the Yucko. <laughs> 
as opposed to putting a see you later on, because you're not going to see any of them later on this. So the temptation is to put the low uh, low grip tires on this and turn it into a, a complete drift machine. But then probably wouldn't do well with my next assignment. Which is, of course, you know where this is going. Can it go up to the eye? That's right. We're just going to... See, it's a coupe. You better make sure it's not raining on this one. Time of day, current. Yeah, let's, let's just make it new. Weather. Clear. Traffic, whatever. Customs are on. Change class to... Coupes. Customs are on a course. There it is. That's the Bruffy Crew with Chrome. In case you're curious, the custom postlude. I'm actually not real confident this is going to be able to do anything useful here. This might be one that we actually have to quit out of because it can't finish. Does the little charm have jiggle bones? It does. Okay, it, does, it bounces around. Good. Alright, not the best launch zone, but we made it. It doesn't feel real stable. Oh yeah, this thing is just getting yeeted all over the place. I think I think Bruffy mentioned that it has that kind of vamos kind of effect to it, where it tends to dart around on bumps. Yeah, this is not a good different car. Not a good G Fred car. Not a good G Fred car. Tends to wander. It won't ride the rails. And then now it's spinning out. Oh, I couldn't even I couldn't even get the right line. Well, it's a front-wheel drive. Will that help us? This isn't even doing a little bit, is it? And it just it just wants to go back down. Hit me with the train. Ah. Okay, so we're we're immediately bailing out. hoping for the train, but... There is a path. So we'll take this. We're just going to go mountain climbing here. Well, mountain walking. Up the trail. I don't think I set to GTA, so I can't... Uh, I have to change that to update this so it defaults to a GTA race. As is proper. Hmm. 
Not a good defred car. It's a Murgatroyd. Oh hell, this isn't good. In case you're curious, no, it won't back up at all. So we have to go down. Okay. We're going to have to have some kind of yeet moment here. That almost worked. Now, can the post lewd kind of allude to posting lewd things? I mean, that's... I know there's changing pre to post, but... Alright, we, we did it. There was, there was a way. Keep the momentum. Oh, it leaped. That was almost disastrous. A little advanced handling flag kind of thing there. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh, don't go that way. Now, you gotta realize, most cars, when you're driving up these things, it's like you're driving on a road. It really doesn't... If you're on this, you shouldn't have too much trouble. Almost, well, I screwed that up, but here we are. Come on. Up the Chiliad. Not good, not good, not good, not good, not new. I don't think there's a recovery here, folks. Not for that rock. And there is a recovery, okay. We have to do this properly though. I didn't want to give up on it because I feel like it could theoretically do this. Not well. Not well by any stretch. I think that's where I eated it last time, come on. If I don't bounce, like you want to keep the momentum up, but you don't want to hit a bounce too hard and have it go yeet. And it's, at this point, maybe the lowered suspension you think isn't helping, but you get more traction that way. It actually handles better. It's like one of those things you gotta do.
Come on. Come on. It, it must have pretty good traction because I think it's just traction is what it's living on. I don't think it has power. But it didn't make it up to yet. Now, can it go down? Down is usually just a matter of how much style are you doing it in? Are you driving it down or are you just falling down uncontrollably? Freaks are squeaking. I'm trying to perfect where we're just flying. Did not get did not get the path I wanted on that. I know where I wanted it to go and it did not go there. It's not doing what I want right now. But we're gonna get down. Here we're down, but we're way too far down. Okay. And there's the train. And we jumped the train! Ooh, wow. The car doesn't really deform at all. I mean, it, that's almost silly. I mean, I just hit the train, it didn't even bend the hood. I don't know why they put armor on it, but... Dead gum. So the question is, does this get launched into some water at some point? We made the hole. But yeah, really, it's just darting back and forth on me. So this, there's a lot of unpredictability here. Yeah. One more time. One last water, and then we go, yay, yeet! Dink racing, racing the post ludes. Why don't you post ludes? Post lude, post nudes. There you go. Don't don't post nudes. It's it's not good for you. It almost landed itself. All right. Okay, can we remember... Alright, yeah, let's try the jump! No, that's not even... That wasn't even close. This could be problematic right here, I'll tell you that much. Like I said, I don't think it has power. I think it has good traction. At least enough traction. The, full, the front wheel drive. That it does just keep chugging along. Still can't do the hot lap route. You can make it up chili head, but not up the hot lap. Not even close. I wasn't trying to hit that guy. I was just like, it just is what it is.
done and finished in style. And there you have it. So I have myself a, a slow little brown car. And you know what, ladies and gentlemen, there's nothing wrong with that. Especially if you can do it with a little bit of style, right? Even if you can't. If you have, if you out there have yourself a slow little brown car, you should be thankful you have a slow little brown car. It'll get you around. Now that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.